Thanks for stopping by the YouTube channel, The Mortgage Moment, hosted by me, Mark Taylor. Today's topic that we're going to cover that's going to be really exciting and help you increase your business even more than the business that you're doing currently or the business that we're helping you with is e-property sites and their little widget called e looky -loo that drives buyers and sellers to you. So what I wanted to do was today show you one, how to find e looky -loo, and two, how to post it on all of your Craigslist ads as we've already posted it. Uh, if you're watching this video, we've already typically posted it into your active rain and covered your blogs, but it's an extra little step that's well worth it. For those of you who don't know what e looky -loo is, e looky -loo allows, allows you to generate leads into your lead pool over here. Let's look in our account of our friend Nick here, who I'm about to install for him, uh, the e looky -loo widget. Uh, don't forget, gang, every time I have something new and different to say, we post the videos on your front page here in ePropertySites. Sites. But if you go to Leads Pool under the Leads tab, you'll see that currently there are no leads. Um, there have been a couple of people that have popped in. This is before we've done anything. And later on, we're going to talk about campaigns, letters, lists, options, your notification setting, all of that good stuff, exactly what to do and how to set it up. But for, for the most part, right now, today, I'm simply going to show you how to install this widget so that when you do log in, your lead pool is full. So basically, what you're going to do is you're going to be back at your main screen, typically. These are the properties that Nick has put in. You're going to click your Setup tab. And inside Setup are Picture, Personal Bio, Options, Personal URL, Website that you can set up. Again, another video for another time. And the past orders that you have done. You always want to make sure that this is complete. Nick Wilson, his website, what his blog would be, which would be his Active Rain blog, can go in here. Um, your license description, your MLS should always be A R M L S, so we know you're part of that board. That your company, your uh, where it's based, your Facebook, your LinkedIn, your Twitter, your YouTube. As you know, it automatically syndicates e property sites, syndicates everything for you within. Uh, those media platforms and you're simply going to go to the options tab right here there's a leads backlink this is the blog that we've placed e looky loo onto for Nick and you want to take the e looky loo widget which is this button here and you want to add it to your Craigslist poster so let me show you how to do that now, for those of you listening, they're going, well, I'm confused about the Craigslist poster. What is the Craigslist poster? The Craigslist poster is an opportunity for you to post your properties every three days from e-property sites into uh, Craigslist. I'm going to show you how to do that. And also, you should be posting once a week a little Craigslist advert that says, hey, want to search the MLS for your home? Search like I do for free. Whatever the title is that you want to be uh, discovered for. Search the MLS like a realtor, no sales calls, free service. And then all you do is you post this looky loo widget right here into the Craigslist ad. So let me show you how that works. You simply take this description, control C on a PC, command C on a Mac, which is copy. You go over to your properties tab. This is one of the properties here that we're going to post for Nick. You're going to hit Craigslist. Click a radio button here and it will shoot this layout out. Click proceed. And here you will have two windows created. One on the left all the information for Craigslist. As those of you may know, Craigslist has banned single posting and one-click posting because of the level of spam and all the problems that they were having clogging up their servers, so they've eliminated that. 
So if you want to be discovered and have properties found and get more buyers, then posting on Craigslist is extremely important. Clicking housing offered, real estate by broker. This property is in Mesa, so it's West Valley. Now what we do is we simply cut and paste this into here. What I'm going to do very, very first is before I take my description and pop it over, I'm going to put in that code right here, which was the eLookyLoo code. I'm going to tab down. Now I can take everything over here without destroying my original link, which was this. Control C, Control V, three bedrooms, square feet, 1649. The description is a single bedroom, single family detached. And it's in Mesa. Oops. See, even I can make mistakes, game. Put down here the street. It's in Mesa. State is Arizona. Click continue. And here's what you have. A property ready to post on Craigslist with an e looky loo widget, and I'll show you what that does in a minute. And Nick is actually borrowing another agent's listing, which is why you have all these capitals that Google doesn't like, as you know. So um, I know Nick to be very diligent. He'll go back and change the description to a three-bedroom, two-bathroom Mesa home. Um, and we'll drop, we'll make these all meet the correct requirements and uh, not have all the capitals in. But there you go. Click continue here. It's asking me for my phone number. And then you simply um, via text message, send the code, it'll send me a text. I'll pump it in here and off it will go onto the world of Craigslist. So basically, gang, that's pretty much how you go from your property section, posting out to Craigslist, and providing an e looky -loo search. And if we go to see what an e looky -loo search looks like, you can look at one of my blogs. This is one I posted today. You can click an e looky -loo button, which is what all your consumers are going to do. And they're going to arrive here. And then they can simply type in what they're looking for. Click go. Properties within their price point will, will pop up. And then they can look at all these properties supported by Listing Hub. And they can decide if they like it or if they don't. But how we capture their information is if they think it's yucky or yummy, they're asked to sign up or log in. And this is how we capture high quality leads to you and have them pumped back into your leads log and lead pool right here, just as Nick had done on the last two that came in yesterday, 1021. Okay, so this is the people that are looking for properties. These are their contact information. And that's pretty much what we do, gang. 
So hopefully this helps you understand how exactly to go from your properties screen into your setup tab into your options tab to get your eLookyLoo widget to paste it into your Craigslist ad so that every ad you goes out has a leads back link to eProperty sites and the ability to capture new buyers for you. And a hot tip for you, something that I always, always recommend is having a cheat sheet. And a cheat sheet that I use is my blogging examples here. This is a new FHA loan with a 580 FICO that I post on Craigslist. Here's my happy birthday script for Facebook. You've seen that. I've never known how to create it. Here's um, a blog example that I use that's, uh, that got us on the front page of Google exactly how to use it. Here are my YouTube tags, my YouTube widget. And then down here is my anchoring script for all of you on ActiveRain. And then um, right here is the eLookyLoo widget that I use. Okay, so I use that, cut and paste it into all my documents. So get used to doing that. Post it into your email signatures. Let's start driving some serious traffic uh, for you and giving you some buyer seller leads. As always, gang, really appreciate you very much. We appreciate your support. For further questions or information, give me a ring 602-361-0707. Or visit my YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash the mortgage moment. Take care.